So I'm actually renovating my bathroom. I'm gonna show you what's the before before I renovate it or before I do a makeover. This is the door it has a hole here. I wonder why this toilet there. But of course there's another hole here. I'm gonna change all of that. Alright. I don't know how to flip this. How do you flip this? Look. Hmm? So can you flip it? No. Alright, so I've already changed one thing on it and I forgot to organize it. I put this under the sink storage. Okay. This was an old storage that's orange, so I painted pink and put marble contact paper on top. And so this is how it looks like on top of it. Yep, I know. I've not cleaned, I've not done anything else. Um, I want to show you first before I do anything on the kitchen. I mean the bathroom. And it's very green. This I'm going to paint of course. It's green. I'm not sure if I'm going to paint the whole bathroom or make it just yeah, green. I know it sucks, yeah. And even our light here needs to be. So we have to change that. Hello, hello everyone. So after a few weeks, I finally am in a place where I can show you what I've done with the bathroom. It's not 100% complete yet. I'm sure I would change it more in the near future. But for now, I'm happy with it. So. Overall, the reason I'm showing you this now is because this is how it's gonna look like for a while until I change my mind again. Alright, so I hope you're ready. Kina po ang aming bagong or newly be renovated eh. Makeover lang po. Na bathroom or toilet or whatever you call it. Maliit lang po ang bathroom ko. If you've seen the before pictures and before video, yan. Um, so, una ko pong ginawa ay ito po ay kulay orange po yan. Pinagalaan ko po ng pink at nilagyan ko siya ng marble contact paper sa top. Yung mismo cabinet po na yan ay cabinet po yan sa taas. Maliit. Eh, medyo bumaharang po siya sa pinto sa tayo binaklas po namin siya at ginawa ko na lang po ganyan. Medyo matagal na po siya actually namin binaklas before. Ngayon ko lang naisip na pwede siyang gawin parang pedestal sink ang tawag nila. Ayun, ginayayan ko ng pink kasi yan po ang natira kong um, pintura from other projects that I did. So, yan. I've did. I have did. Double na mali. Anyway, Tapos, ito pong rack, binili ko po sa shop ito. Ito pong spice jars, binawa, binagyan ko ng, uh, ano ba tawag dyan? Panglinis ng tenga, whatever. At ang mga bulak, tatlo pong peraso to, nilagay ko po dito yung isa. Wala pa po ako nilalagay. 99 pesos lang po yan sa SM. Ito din po, binili ko sa SM. Ito sa Shopee po. Kung gusto nyo bumili po nito, i-PM nyo na lang po ako. Tapos, yan. Um, kinailangan, hindi ko na po dapat ito ilalagay pero gusto ng asawa ko meron pa siyang mirror dito para pag nagsushave siya malapit sa sink so, ito po, kulay orange po ito kung nakita niya yung before pictures kulay orange po siya Pinit ay pinituraan ko na din po ng pink dahil yun na po tira na lang din po na pintura sa mga previous projects po at saka para mag match naman po siya dito so, ang parang theme ko po ngayon ay pink, white, and green. Na pinagbibili ko po yung mga stores na yan. It's either Japan Surplus or department stores, SM department stores. Ito po ay nabili ko lang sa surplus shop din. Na pre-owned na po actually. Acrylic um, storage boxes. Nabili ko po ito sa All Home. Ito, um, yan po ay mga box na binigay sa akin Nabili ko sa boxing, ganyan. Ito din po, ito na po, binili. Ito, dati na po sa akin to eh. Tapos ito lang ang binili ko ulit. Kasi dati ang nakalagay dito na bulaklak or 
plastic flowers eh nilagay ko na po yung stash. So, makikita niyo po yung crown molding. Kulay orange pa din siya. Hindi ko pa siya napipinturahan. Like what I said uh, earlier, hindi pa talaga 100% complete. Ito, binig ko sa Japan surplus. Mm, at tas, inilagay ko siya dyan. Um, ano ba to? Hindi ko po din nililil yan. Actually, bulkasil lang po yan. One of the strongest parang paste ba or any stuff na makakapag-stick sa bathroom is yung bulkasil. Yun, based on my experiences, itong corner shelf na to, binili ko po yan sa Shopee. May kita niyo po ang dami kong achuchu sa buhay. Mga soaps ko, ilan? Yung ginagamit. Tapos, ito sa mga bata to, saka sa asawa ko, ilan sa asawa ko. Tapos, yung shower, nilagay ko na up. Mm, kung mapapansin nyo, ang pinakamalaking difference na nagawa ko rito is tanggalin yung malaking drum or container ng tubig na kulay black. At pinalitan ko lang siya ng maliit, tapos naglagay na nga lang ako ng shower. Ito, ibinalik ko to. Dati, nakalagay siya rito, um, natanggal siya na wala ng screw. So, ang ginawa ko, yun nga, naglagay na ako ng drum, tapos yung shower head nakababag na lang dun. So, ngayon, sabi ko, maybe it's about time to remove ay, to put this back. Tapos, iurong na lang dito kasi matatamaan na yung corner shelf. Tapos, ihang na ulit yung shower. And, liitan na lang namin yung container or yung... Kasi, alam mo na, Pilipino, kailangan pa rin natin ng tabo at saka ng balde para maligo. And, for all. Tapos, ito yan, yung mop ko. And, pang clean. For that's it. That's what I did. Wala. Ang ginasus ko po dito, wala pa pong 1.5. Kasi, ang mga binili ko na lang talaga na bago is ito, ito, which is mga tagmang na 99 pesos, 100. Itong shelf, actually, medyo ma mahal siya. Um, ito din, medyo mahal din po yan. Saka yung corner, corner, ano ba tawag dyan? Multi-shelf. Yan, tas dinagdagang ko lang nito at saka nung, nung dalawang green. So, wala talaga akong masyadong ginasus. Even the paints, um, kasi meron na akong paint. Itong contact paper, meron na akong yan. Ito, ito din yung ko. Ay, yun pa po wala yung bala ko. In this corner, kasi alam ko medyo saan na pa kasi ito eh, sa shower curtain. Pero hindi kami maglalagay ng kasi the bathroom is really small. Like what I've heard sa mga video na na ano ba to? Pinapanood ko sa YouTube. If your bathroom is really small, make it look ay, put yung, yung mata ng tao pagka pumasok, ilagay mo sa taas. So that it doesn't, they don't see it as too small. Which is medyo mataas naman po yung ceiling ko, so maganda. Taas nga po nito yun. Oh. Yeah. So, ang bala ko lang ulit, lagyan na lang man dito ng container. Like, pay something here. Not please, I don't know, put something in there. I was thinking of something like this. Yung pala niya, yung parang sa magazine rack. Pero mas maliit kasi nung tinry ko to, lagpas-lagpas siya eh. So, mas maliit na ganun. Which, I don't know kung may mga na po. Kung hindi ganyan, parang manipis na pag ganun na lang. Hmm, lalagay ko siya. Siguro isa or dalawa. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do that. Eh. Kasi I'm pretty happy with what I have right now. Ito din, bala ko sana siyang lagyan ng parang artwork lang. Parang frame lang na may picture or something. Yan lang. I know it doesn't sabi nyo hindi naman to bonggang makeover. That's not my point here. That's not what I, that's not why I made the video. If you've seen the previous video or previous um, photos, makikita nyo malaki yung naging difference niya in fairness. Gusto ko lang um, ma, ma, ma show din sa mga followers ko, sa mga nga doon videos ko na you can do a lot of, kung medyo nasisikipan kayo sa sa restroom nyo dahil sa Pilipinas, ma, usually maliniit po talaga ang restroom. Meron, you have to just make quick or small changes, just paint a little, use your organizers more, um, remove clutters that you've not used for 10,000 years, remove those things, and you can make it look a little bit bigger. I feel like my our restroom is a little bit bigger now. You just have to make use of this top space, the corner spaces. Yan lang po. And then remove a big drum if you don't need it. 
which I don't think I do. I would need it probably pagka nawawala ka ng tubig. So, yun, nasa labahan lang naman mo namin yun. Kukunin lang namin, lalagay lang ulit na. It's not a problem. But for now, I've had this restroom like this for maybe a week already before I decided to show you. Okay naman po kami. Actually, masaya-masaya yung mga bata sa shower. Sobrang saya nila sa shower. See you lang. Marami pong salamat. Bye! Now that you've seen it, I know that you would say that it's not much change, you know. Whatever, it's not the best makeover. Or, but if you've seen the old on how it looks like before, you would see there were a lot of changes. And I didn't have to buy a lot of things. It's basically just new paint, just a couple of new racks and new storage organizers and that's it. And just remove clutter basically and hide those clutter that can't be removed from the bathroom like like Domex, you know, and all that. So I hope you guys liked the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I did. I enjoyed makeover, the makeover. So yeah. Again, you don't have, you just make use of what you have. If you have extra paint, extra storage, use that.